The fondest memory is Chinese New Year is very, very big, very big. It's, it's like Christmas here. And uh, night before we go to bed before the New Year's Day, we know everything will be new the next day. But uh, we go to bed listening to a lot, a lot of firecrackers outside. She really emphasized how fun Chinese New Year was. And a big part of it, she said her favorite memory was going out as a child as into the street and just seeing the whole street covered in red from the firecrackers, because the firecrackers were used to scare away evil spirits from last year. So the next morning, when you get up and you open the front door and you look out, the whole street would be red. Hopefully she feels like a remembrance of her childhood and she described how she really liked the Chinese New Year time period because um, when like the firecrackers went off everything was like really joyous chaotic and then so she liked that time. <laughs> so anyway the whole street was red and it's so pretty it's just uh, very hard to explain that when you get up and we used to just like to look at it. She was Younger, her favorite part of Chinese New Year was always the excitement the day of New Year and how she'd walk outside and there'd be paper everywhere from the fireworks and everything would be red. Red is uh, like a very good luck color to Chinese. I, I think the, the most important part of the New Year to share with the student truly is really how we um, emphasize uh, in the tradition of family. It is a family, I would say, celebration. Gong Hei Fa Choi, you know, Gong Hei Fa Choi, you know, is we are uh, wishing you a lot of prosperity in the coming year.